All right. Waiting for Garrett. Gonna go on a little New Year's Day ride. It's been a while since we went for a ride, it seems like. The old, good old Can-Am here. He doesn't come up on camera very well, but we're headed way up to the mountain up there. Not to the top or anything. But just out for a ride. Hoping to have some fun. Uh, doesn't look like we'll get into much snow or anything like that. I mean, we live in the desert. Snow lasts for about two days, so we'll see what happens. Well, Garrett finally showed up. Been waiting here for like 35 minutes. There's no way you're going to laugh. Brought his kid. I brought one kid. One kid. Nobody likes Garrett enough to come with him. So Garrett's riding solo on his machine. He can sit between me and Tasha. Seriously. Got a bump seat? <laughs> yeah. to be riding his dirt bike. Jason, how's it going? Good. About dumped it over yet? Yeah. <laughs> it's a little slippery. I didn't think we'd get into this much snow. It didn't look like there was anything up this way. No. So I'm quite surprised that there's actually this in the area. So. Yeah. All right, I'm going to mount this up front and we'll keep going. Trying to get it, Dave. Finally. Dave was standing clear over here and I told him, don't get any closer, we don't want you to fall. I don't want to lose that drone. <laughs> I'm so glad he was so concerned for me. <laughs> so as you can see, a little bit more snow out here than we thought from looking from town, that's for sure, but there's definitely some nice scenery out here. So guess we'll get in and uh, See how that thing tracks, huh? Yeah. What are you doing, like the distance? Yeah, that's probably too far. I'll bring it in one.
base of Pine Valley Mountain. It's a spring up there. It brings a lot of water down to St. George, Washington area. It's a big pipeline somewhere around here. Taysen's on the motorcycle. We probably were a little ambitious on what he can do in the snow. So, uh, Yeah, I can see that. I feel like if I'm walking on the track. You better watch out. Oh, it's Garrett. <laughs> All right, Garrett. <laughs> Where's Tayson? Oh my gosh. That's pretty steep right there. It's slippery. Sliding all over. Sorry, Tayson. <laughs> you okay? Yeah. All right. <laughs> he can barely walk out there, right? He's, He's walking up. Hey, we got some hot chocolate we can make. Uh, yeah. Hey, Britt. That's sand hollow. Yeah, we're that so crazy. picking up a lot of people out there. We'll have to change radios again. You hold this, and I'm gonna go down and get the coming winter. All right, so uh, how'd the drone do? Since we got we got caught up back there, Tayson went down, and we freaking slippery as heck in that two stroke, and trying to keep it revved quick enough. Did the drone track you guys all right? Yeah, did a good job. Sometimes it. You freak out, think it's gonna run into some tree limbs or something, because I don't know. And then suddenly it you can't out. see it, and then all of a sudden it's over the trees. Well, that one time coming over where it was in front of you by the trees, I was watching it. it kept on going through the trees. I was like, oh my gosh, dude, that thing's gonna freaking crash. Yeah, we we discovered what happens when it gets low on battery. Oh, uh, what happens? I kept checking the beacon, and I thought it was saying 10% battery. No, it was uh -huh. at 1%. And, then it, and then it said it was landing, <laughs> like, and well, I had no idea. I didn't know where it was. I jumped out of the side by side with my headset still on. I'm like, <laughs> so I, I take the headset off, and I can hear it. Like, it's right here. And then it was just like ten feet off the side, but up the embankment and like hovering. And then like, cool, I can go catch it. But no, it just landed in the powder, wrapped the weed up in the props. But I'm telling you right now. Uh, when you spend that kind of money on drones and you can't find it. Like when we're at the motocross track and all of a sudden it said lost connection and I can't see it anywhere. I thought you are going to die. You get a little paranoid. Is this part of your overlining trailer supplies? No, actually, no. Just I, tell them how awesome your wife is right now. She got up and she was working out and she told me she was going to go for a walk. So working out a definition or a word that Dave and I definitely do not. I don't know what that means really, but how does that come out? But uh, so I guess this thing? it's, on, it's like a stove, like huh? a jet boil, if you know what that is. Um, it's a jet and it boils. Yeah, basically. But she went and bought me a birthday present, and she got home and she's like, "I can't wait to give it to you. Do you want it now? Because my birthday's not until Sunday." Well, but, the thing uh, is, you cook right in the pan then, and then store it in there too, huh? You can, yeah. Like it's like a one-stop shop. So. We figured we'd do some hot chocolate because we'd probably Dave's be cold. Dave's really good with like um, herbal tea, so he just goes around and picks leaves off and boils. <laughs> Again, he's like insane, like survival guy over here. Right. We can put bear grills to shame and all those other fools, whoever they are. Let's oh, see if you get lighted. I, mean, I need I the water that's gas. in there. What water do you need? I got some bottles. Here. Let's grab it. Probably gonna need yeah. another one. <laughs> we need a table as well. <laughs> yeah, why don't you get me a table too? It's already maybe boiling or it's at least steaming hot. 
I don't know if we're going to Whoa. Let's dump all of our hot water out. I'm not to dump boiling water all over myself. Maybe we need a hot pad too. <laughs> Just wondering how you get that off. Yeah, Just turn the it. Campus. There you go. <laughs> Maybe. There it is. So I'm burn myself with that. Try and get about two cups worth in there. I need to laser engrave something on here. Yeah, where'd you get these cups? I think just Walmart. Yeah. Right. They're kind of cool. They got like a like a round line on them. Yeah, heavy duty. So after you have your trash, you just throw it there, and then you get it. <laughs> Put it in the sacket. Dot com. Leave no trace. Leave no trace behind. Yeah, we're doing that. We didn't bring any spoons. Stick time. I, here. I hope it tastes a little more earthy than normal. <laughs> Green landscape out here is awesome. You got like red sandstone rock there, and then you got lava. Pine Valley is a, a lack of lift, largest one in the world, apparently. It's crazy. Uh, what the? Oh, missed from like four feet away. That's pathetic. It's gonna make me spill. <laughs> well. Come on, that's when he's cold. Cold? Put it on there. Wrong with the sticky hat. I dropped it. Here. <laughs> <laughs> Ow! Dude, that's like an ice ball. Well, Natasha ball. said it's perfect snow for making snowballs. <laughs> it is. Did you like sit on that and really compact it or what? Taysen did. And then he put it on his <laughs> pipe and melted the edge a little Freaking bit so it's more water ice. Water on there <laughs> and packing it tight. Seriously. Oh yeah. That hits the spot. Still good, man. I think I did pretty good. It's really good. Hot, <laughs> sticky. My hands are a little sticky now, but you know, whatever. Why'd you spill? Some idiot douche <laughs> nozzles throwing snowballs at me. <laughs> We were a fit. So if you guys haven't seen these, there you go, Camp Chef. Yeah, it's just a Camp Chef one. Walmart. Same thing as a Jet Boil. Where at? Walmart. Walmart. Walmart, or maybe we'll throw an Amazon link too if we can find one below. Yeah, I'm sure it's on Amazon. Yeah, buy it off Amazon through our link so we can make some money. Hey, doesn't it have a cover? Like, this looks like a cover, a holder. Yeah, it's got a lid. And then there it, you go. It comes with a couple different little stands for different size gas bottles. And then you can do a out. big gas bottle, right? And then you can use the green Coleman gas. It's a dual fuel, like it'll use this mixed fuel stuff, uh -huh. butane, propane mix, or just straight propane. So, we'll see if we can find it on Amazon and throw it on there too. It's a pretty sweet yeah, little thing. You can do soup, all that kind of stuff up here with it. Really
make this a episode. I shall la 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 sis. We never a couple I love it when you cuss cuss.